Hi, this is Susan Weinberg, and we've had some questions. I'd like to do a few uh, questions and answers for people with questions that people have asked in the office. The first question that I have here is, what is the latest word on amalgam type fillings? Well, first of all, let me tell you a little bit about amalgam fillings. Amalgam fillings were created in the 1880s and 1890s. It was the state of the art about 130 years ago. They were, um, they're, they're made, of, they're, they're an amalgamation or a combination of mercury, silver, nickel, and other metals. And they're made so that the mercury causes the metals to be soft so that they can be compacted into the tooth and seal up the tooth and make the tooth uh, so that their cavity can be taken out and the filling can be taken, be put in there. I don't do the amalgam fillings anymore. I haven't done them for about 15 years because I don't believe in putting metals and having metals into your body. There's no way that I think that that's good for you. The new filling materials that we use are composites and glass ionomers, which are made of glass and quartz crystals and other uh, combinations that bond to your tooth surface that actually make your tooth stronger instead of the amalgams, which made your teeth, teeth weaker, that seal up the teeth better that have fluoride release, that are tooth colored and look absolutely natural and are compatible with the biting surface of your other teeth and I just love our new filling materials. So no amalgam in my office. If you want that, you'll have to go someplace else.